hi friends in this video we are going to discuss about a core concept in ecology that is why energy flow is unidirectional in an ecosystem first of all starting with the concept of energy flow the ultimate energy source in an ecosystem is a sunlight from the sunlight the energy is fixed by green plants by the process called photosynthesis that constitute the primary producers and also represent the first trophic level and this is eaten up by herbivores that constitute primary consumers or second trophic level and that is further taken up by secondary consumers or carnivores that forms the third trophic level and finally that is eaten up by top carnivores that constitute the fourth trophic level therefore simply energy flow is a transfer of energy from one trophic level to another in a non-cyclic unidirectional manner through a food chain or maybe a food web so this is a food chain there can be food web also this energy flow can occur through food web also food web is simply an interconnected network of food chains now the second question why energy flow is unidirectional suppose 10,000 joule of energy is fixed at first trophic level by green plants only 1000 joule is available at second trophic level only 100 joule is available at third trophic level and only 10 joule is available at fourth trophic level only 10 percent of energy is transferred at each trophic level 90 percent of energy is lost this law is called as 10 percent energy transfer or 10 percent law we have discussed this concept in detail in one of our videos the rest 90% of energy is lost as heat and also this organism use energy for their respiration. So majority of energy is lost during this energy flow. That is why in a food chain there are only 4 to 5 trophic levels. And each step in a food chain is called as a trophic level. The energy flow is called as unidirectional as the energy that is available at the second trophic level is not at all available in the first trophic level similarly in the third and fourth trophic level once the energy is transferred that energy is not available to the previous one previous organisms in the previous trophic levels that is why energy flow is always unidirectional no reverse energy flow is possible as energy is lost forever while passing from one trophic level to the next trophic level Hope you are clear. You are with biologyexamsworry.com. Thank you so much for your support.